Welcome back friends to TV5 News at 9. It's time now for design time. Make sure you get your cell phone out. At, we have that QR code that's right there on your screen and you can scan it for all of the information about today's topic and it's a big one today. We are talking about mattress prices. So important. Now there are some queen mattresses that are advertised from like $299 to $3,000. Can that be that much of a difference? Well, absolutely. There's so many ways to change the components right. of a mattress. So we've talked in the past yeah. about the steel springs. Yeah. You know, some could have no springs, some could have 300, and some could have 800. The cost of the spring can be a big variable in that mattress, plus the padding and the mm -hmm. covers. So there are a lot of differences inside the bed. So how do we know that we're getting a good mattress for a fair price? Well, unfortunately, a lot of times I see advertised maybe uh, a $300 bed okay. compared to uh, a more expensive bed. The, the thing that when they say comparison is it looks like, it's the size, it has a fabric, they don't talk about quality. Mm. And you have to understand that there are the differences inside. If we talk about cars, yeah. okay, we have cars that are lower end prices. They maybe don't have all the features, mm -hmm. but then you have higher end and they can be thousands of dollars more, but they have backup cameras and yes. all sorts of electronics. It's going to be similar in a mattress. We don't have the electronics, but what kind of components are actually put inside the weight of the coil, the quality of the padding will make the difference in that price. Mm. What else should we know before signing on the dotted line? Well, recognize that certain beds come with certain warranties, mm. so that's an important factor. Yeah. Um, a lot of stores are liking to say, well, you can do this and it's half off, or mattress manufacturers build mattresses at all different prices. And if you're gonna buy a bed that's $299, recognize it probably was designed to sell for $299. Mm. Stores have to make some profit to stay in business. Mm. So they can't be giving you half off and free bedding and free everything and stay in business because you, when it comes down to the bottom, they still have to make some kind of profit on that. But you want to make sure what you're getting works. Now, mm. you may want a lower price mattress for a spare room that you hardly ever use, right. but I would always tell someone to buy a better bed for themselves, put the dollars into something new for you and maybe move yours which isn't too bad but move it into that spare room mm -hmm. or up to the cottage because the variables in mattresses are extreme and it's just a big box and if you don't know what you're buying $2.99 is too expensive. Right. So you really need to focus on quality when you're getting for that longevity. Yes. You always talk yes. about that. Okay, well, thank you. Anything else you want to let us know before we go out and get Well, this? people are yeah. always concerned about uh, being green. And yeah. I'll tell you, <laughs> buy a good mattress and keep it. The breakdown of a mattress in and when you throw it away can take a couple hundred years for oh, wow. fabrics, foams, steel springs to all break down. We, we like to be green and mm -hmm. save water bottles and right. all of that, but I'm gonna tell you, buy a better quality mattress and keep it for a long time. Your investment will be the least mm -hmm. and you will be helping the environment. Oh, definitely. We want to save Mother Earth, that's for sure. Thank you, yes. Cassie. Thank we you. We appreciate this information. Thank you, friends, for watching this edition of Design Time.